everyone and welcome back to another joypad music review or reaction on the joypad channel today uh i am lucky enough to be reviewing a song that has not released yet so the official release date for 20 somethings disregard is this friday which would be the uh give me a second for fourth the the, the fourth the fifth i'm not the fourth i'm currently recording this on august 31st because um i have been lucky enough to be given a sneak preview so that i could do this video uh ben who i have played shows with before uh, it's been quite a long time due to first of all the fact that i'm not in a band anymore and second the fact of uh the pandemic but he asked if i could do a review for this and the fact that I get to hear the song early was enough for me to be like, hell yeah, man. So if you haven't checked out 20-something yet, there are a band from upstate New York, pop punk, but uh, there's some like easy core and or hardcore influences in there. Um, if you haven't checked out my review of Great White Buffalo, I suggest you pause this video and go check that out first. It's okay. I'll wait. Okay, so you did that. I, no one, do, no one, do, no one does that. When you say pause the video and go check out this other thing, no one does that. If you did do that, prove prove it. Just say in the comments that that's what you did. But I get to check out Disregard, which will officially come out on September fourth. If you want to hear the song, here it is. I'm going to let the song play its in its entirety. That way, if you really like it. You can listen to it and ignore everything I say. But I have babbled on long enough. This is Disregard by 20 something. Don't 
I mean, I have nothing negative to say about it. There's a, there's a couple things that I want to point out. First of all, as far as I know, um, when I last played with 20-something, which was over a year ago at this point, unfortunately, uh, they were still a three-piece. I believe they're a four-piece now. So that means I, I think Connor is the second guitarist. That makes sense. Um, so it's Adam, Ben, Mikey, and Connor. And, you know, hearing a second guitar in there really fills out the sound. You know, a big problem I've had with pop punk in general, and part of why I left my pop punk band, is that um, a lot of the songs are just so straightforward and there's not a lot of variation. You know, they manage to mesh that sort of, you know, it, it really leans more towards punk than pop. So if you want to call it pop punk, you can, but they have much more of the, an edge to their sound. Like I said, you can really hear those sort of hardcore influences in the drums and also the riffing. Um, there's a lot of variation in the guitars. There's not just, you know, chugging straight power chords, which is a big problem that I have with pop punk and why I was kind of not as into it anymore towards the tail end of my career in my band. There's a lot of variation. Um, you can hear a lot of riffing going on. And yeah, I, I'm sorry, like I don't remember which of you is the vocalist, but I, I said this in my review for Great White Buffalo. Whoever the singer is has a unique voice and it cuts right through all the instrumentation sometimes it can really blend in and not stand out but it, it definitely stands out you can definitely hear the power in the vocals the song is mixed well so that the vocals stand out and pop over the instrumentation um what else was i gonna say it was something else Oh, I would, uh, in, in terms of the video itself, you know, it's a lyric video. It's not a music video, if you will. It's still really well done. You know, obviously, it, it looks like it's professionally done. If it's not, whoever you got to do the video did a great job. Uh, the lyrics, of course, I know your obsession with aliens and all that good stuff. You know, the lyrics... Are fine you know um, a lot of pop punk the lyrics are kind of like derivative or or stereotypical not so much a problem here and yeah I just think it was really good I kind of want to listen to it I mean I definitely want to listen to it again I have that power because I have access to the unlisted video but if you guys want to hear it again to um, hear the song. I can actually timestamp it so that you can just hear the song again and listen to just the music. But yeah, I think it's really good. Um, I, I look forward to hearing the entire, I don't know if it's going to be an album or an EP, but as an indication of the other music that's going to be released, judging it off of just this song, I'm going to be way into it. Um, I really liked the first EP, which I'm going to look it up now. I can't remember what it's called, but I I jam out to that all the time. Um, especially when it's nice out. I don't know. For some reason, it gives me that vibe of... I distinctly remember driving to the uh, post office. It was extraterrestrial. Yeah. So, I highly suggest checking out 20 something if you have not heard of them do it go listen to extraterrestrial this song will officially be out in a couple days you can listen to it there and i'm gonna listen to it again for certain so i hope you all like it um again like it's just refreshing a lot of i i have fallen out of listening to pop punk like pretty hard you know, a lot of the bands that I was really into, and they're still around now, bands like Newfound Glory, Blink, I just, I find a lot of them to be kind of grating, and, you know, maybe it's because, 
you know, they're, they're 40 year old dudes, you know, 40 still playing pop punk. And I don't want to say that pop punk is a young man's game, but I myself, you know, I'm 31 and I just, I'm not as into it anymore either. So I don't know, but this, this is refreshing. And again, I refer to it as pop punk, but it's more than that. You can definitely hear other, other influences in there. And it really kind of is unique and breaks the mold a little bit more than your, your standard fare that you're hearing from a lot of those older bands that have been around for a very long time. So yeah, uh, I would say keep up the good work, guys. Definitely want to hear more. Looking forward to the new album. And I hope that other people check this out that have not heard of this band and really get into it. So thank you for watching. Thank you to the guys at 20 something for letting me hear the, uh, early release of this and giving me the chance to review it. I hope all the good things happen. That is all. Thank you for watching. Please leave a comment down below, uh, show the band some love. You can find them on Instagram and Facebook. I don't know about the other social media, but they're all super cool dudes and show them some love. Show me some love in the comments. Like, comment, subscribe, share, and then that's about it. I hope you have a wonderful night and or day wherever you are, and I will see you in the next video. But until then, stay joyful. <laughs>